Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back. Today, we are going to be snorkeling the Honda Foreman. Now, I already have it pretty much ran. I'm gonna show you guys how I did it. I have to finish up the vent lines and put in the air box. I will explain to you guys how to run your Honda Foreman snorkel. probably have your air box in but mine is not in as you can tell but i um there is a stock snorkel that runs up from the air box around and comes up here i cut off the end of that put it into a one and a quarter to one and a half inch coupler ran down do some one and a half inch pvc all the way down past the mud flap on the inside of the shock to a 45 going on the inside of the shock to a straight piece of one and a half to a 45 to another 45 upwards then throw the plastics in the middle all the way up and then there you go pretty easy actually it's actually like really really easy the one on the honda 420 that you guys used to see was way harder than that now for vent lines the top of the gas cap of course that rear diff vent right there. The carburetor vent on that side of the carburetor right there. And then this vent on that side of the carburetor. I plugged them into two and then ran it up all the way down up to the top. Then you got your front diff vent right there. And last but not least, this one's not required, but I'm going to run it. It is the fan vent right there so in total i have five vent lines and uh, i would have had six but i spliced the two on the carburetor together so that's really it for the pvc side and the vent line side of the snorkel now on to the air box you're going to go to your local like auto parts store and pick you up some so come ultra black and just go all around this boot, that boot, and this boot too. Come on, focus. There you go. So it should kind of like this. Show you guys all the way around the boots. Here for this part, you don't have to do it, but I usually do. Take a little bit of that stuff and go all on the insides of the boots also all around the inside. But I'll hit this for you guys again. So you're gonna cut the air box to a, to a one and a quarter, one and a half, all the way down to a 45, to a straight piece, to a 45, to a piece in the middle, to a 45, all the way up through the plastics, and then boom, you're done. You're gonna do rear diff, tank front diff two on the carburetor and then if you want you can do the one on the pan also hi boys so we have the air box in tighten up that clamp that clamp put on your crankcase hose and you're done now we need to put some glue right there and right there and put up the up pipe and to zip tie all these lines and we're done all right boys so the pvc glue is done and drying so now let's run up these lines up to the top of the snorkel and we're done boys all right boys we are finally done with the snorkel look at this thing boys got all the vent lines ran up to the very top of that snorkel i still have to cut off this tag on the zip tie but all glued up, all on. She should be sealed, boys. All right, boys. So I'm going to go ahead and close off this video now. I hope you guys will hike the snorkel on the old foreman. We will be at Hogwaller.
for Mother's Day weekend. I think it's like the 12th or the 13th of May. So I'll see you guys there with this Honda. She's going to either sink or swim, boys. We'll see. Hog wall already. I'll catch you boys on the next one.